All right, number nine, the first ever coin circulated in the United States. The Fujio Cent. Ben Franklin designed this coin and it was minted in 1787. On one side, there was a sun and sundial and the words, mind your business, it oh, turns out. Live by. <laughs> the phrase meant something different back then. It was less mind your own business and more pay attention to your affairs. Ah. Yeah. On the other side of the coin are the words, we are one. There are also 13 chains all interlocked representing the 13 original colonies. Oh, Boy, wow. and you're a coin collecting club. That must go for oh, big bucks, Larry. Yeah, How's that talk. going for you? Yeah, well. Are you still the vice president of that? Or uh, have you the, taken, it's a club of one. <laughs> yeah, so far, I'm, I'm looking for members, yeah. but nobody seems that interesting. Oh, boy. Uh, number eight, your workout will never be the same again. Check this thing out. It's the Lifespan Fitness Cycle Boxer. You're not just getting the benefits of a full stationary bike. You also get to punch stuff. Oh, gosh. Uh, the built-in punch pad in front allows you to work those arms while you're working the lower part of your body. Probably, I, I don't understand the reaction. Plus, it might be an option if you're not interested in watching a screen or following a virtual instructor. It's That's not cheap, the problem. Though. I'd like to watch TV it's while I'm doing Twenty-five hundred bucks on Amazon. Well, and Can it's you really not put even a price on fitness. It's not enough to that you're riding a bike. You have to be working. You have to be boxing at the same time. Is it enough that I'm pedaling? You're not. Well, Can you're I not pedaling either. That's you know. I mean, well, I'm not. Yeah. But I mean, I'm just saying one thing at a time is plenty yeah. for me. I mean, don't. It's like you feel guilty that you're not boxing while you're biking now, right? How could you feel guilty? You don't do any of it. Yeah. I know, but I'm just saying if I did, you know, yeah. theoretically, yeah. Right. you know, let's just uh, let people have baby steps. What's wrong with baby steps? You start mm -hmm. riding the bike and then you have to be, you, you know. must be up to your ears in guilt for everything that you don't do that you should be doing. <laughs> Right? There's a lot of guilt, That's Larry. That's a nice yeah. idea. Generations. Am I lying, Pat? No, you're not lying the there. The guilt never stops. Generations instilled oh. in us. Mm -hmm. You only knew the conversations that take place on this desk. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a guilt sandwich, oh. Larry. All right, number seven, with a face like Fabio, you're going to want to protect your moneymaker. Do you know Fabio, Morgan? Oh. Well, back in 1999 on a out. roller coaster, he used to be the face of all the romance novels. Oh. Fabio. They'd, okay. they'd, they'd draw him and oh, take his picture. Is, anyway, is this is him on a roller coaster okay. in 1999. He didn't quite have enough protection. He opted aboard Apollo's chariot at Busch Gardens Williamsburg as part of a media blitz for the new ride. Coaster took off. Two minutes later, it was clear something went wrong. Apparently, a goose smacked Fabio right in the sh <laughs> in the yeah. schnoz in the middle of the ride. And wait till you see when he comes back. Oh. Oh. Yeah, it was a nightmarish day I for America. I don't remember this at all. Oh, no. Oh, Look at the I little do. girls laughing. <laughs> but I mean, what are the odds? Wow. Of course, we did show that video the other day, the girl on that, that yeah. slingshot ride where she yeah. hit a bird. She was yeah. brave, just grabbing that. Yeah, look at this. You don't remember where you were when this happened? I oh, do this, not. To me, this was that like the moon bad. landing. I knew where I was. <laughs> he um, was okay, just a little bloody. Study hall, somebody came running in. But when that's your money maker. Yeah. yeah. He still looks sensational, though. Well, how old is Fabio? I was now? just going to say, we haven't question. heard from him lately. <laughs> you read this one, Morgan. I'll get Let on that. Let me know, yeah. Uh -huh. All right, number six dog pools are more popular than ever right now. It used to be you head to the store, pick up one of those cheap plastic mm -hmm. pools, and throw your kids in there, and the dog, and maybe yourself. But now there are specifically made pools for pups. They've got thicker liners to accommodate dog nails, and they've got special sizes depending on your dog's size. I have one of these, you guys. No. So. <laughs> yes, I do. It's big, big, it's big business, but they're not cheap either. Uh, one Google search will end up with hundreds of options at just about every price point, some fancier than others, depending on how much you like your dog. You don't want to buy one for $11 outside of Jewel? I know, That's my dog is like for the dog. 10 pounds, too. I really I, didn't need all that. Mine doesn't like the water at all. Well, 
much like me. Yeah. <laughs> Soulmate. Apple like, tree. Yeah. All right next to each other. Yeah. I didn't realize genetics were passed on to your friends. <laughs> <laughs> but the dog does love running away. Right. So that's well, one you thing know what? they don't share. I don't know if you can you put up my computer because this is what Morgan was. We got Fabio now? Is that what we got? Oh no, this was I wanted to show this picture because oh. Morgan was talking about this earlier. Yeah. How the dog <laughs> this was my dog when he came to WGN and this is how he looks at me all the time. And then he gets in the weather office with Morgan and it's like joy just burst yeah. from him. So I think it's maybe well, just spending you know, it's, time it's with people. He, he'd never been around anybody else who'd experienced joy. <laughs> so once he was around someone, he was like, what is this new wonderful right. feeling? Yeah. I'm not angry and upset. <laughs> I mean, it's just like, it's not just, I'm not, I'm not frowning. It's like yeah. this. It's so much ah, joy. Ja, ja. It's like jazz hands for a dog. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what the heck? Anyway, whatever. Right. Number five, it was 1992, and uh, Barks Root Beer needed uh, an aggressive ad campaign to compete with the cola giants. The Soviet Union had just fallen, so they ran a Soviet Union is going out of business sale. Take a look. The promotion resulted in a 30% increase in The Soviet Union is out of business, and Corby's loss is your gain. No, that is <laughs> Barks Root Beer has acquired a huge inventory of really neat stuff. Authentic Soviet pins, like new Mayday flags, communist party papers, and more. They're yours free from Barks. Look for details on specially marked 12 packs for two liters of Barks Root Beer. The one with bite. This is uh, a once in a lifetime offer, so quit Stalin. Pick up Barks and take a oh, bite. Stalin. Oh, what? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, there you go. Hmm. Uh, number four, if you've watched any Olympic events, uh, diving events, you might have wondered something. Why do sprinklers spray water over the surface of the pool between dives? Oh. You might think to yourself, this doesn't make any sense, but it does. It's a safety measure to aid the divers in their visual perception of the water's surface. Huh. Sprinklers create ripples across the water, so it's easier uh. for divers to see how far they are from the surface of the pool. Huh. But that. just enough that it doesn't disrupt yeah. the water, right? Because you want no splash right in there. That huh. is the most, watching that platform diving is the most terrifying thing when they're yeah. standing on the yeah. edge of that. I don't know how they do it. And not a ripple. They dive in like a blade yeah. going in the water. Unbelievable. No. Yeah, anyway. In those tiny little panties. <laughs> don't right? say that word. <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised you could even watch with them. I, just... I'm amazed. Well, I'm an athlete, Pat, right. and I game recognizes game. Game recognizes game. Is like you game to say. <laughs> All right, number three. Check this out. It's Marilyn Monroe. This photo was published in 1958. That's Marilyn Monroe. Really? That's all the, that's the only, I don't know. Is it? They say it is. I've never seen that. That doesn't look like her. Boy, that. Really? I'm sure everything's I was wondering there. if we have everything <laughs> pixelated yeah. the way it's supposed to, but you know, if not, it's too late. Yeah, a little too late now. Anyway, wow. there we go. Okay. <laughs> Number two, about a hundred years ago, knees were the thing. Oh yeah. It was considered sexy and a bit naughty to show them off. Some ladies even painted their knees. It started with the infamous nightclub singer and vaudeville star Velma Kelly. She liked to roll down her stockings, rouge her knees, and paint the town. Mm -hmm. The painted knee trend soon turned to painted knee art. It was a form of expression for women and a way to take some power back over mm. their bodies. Wait, isn't Velma Kelly the one who was no idea. portrayed in the, the, longer you drag the movie, this story the on. musical Chicago? She was a real person? talking about it, I'm going to have to, I'm trying Is, to restrain myself well, from asking about Well, I thought about that name was based on a, on a woman named somewhat something else. Yeah. Velva Gartner is what well, it says, but I don't know. We got time. You know what? I, <laughs> all right. Yeah, we got it. You know, we minutes. learned together. Oh, and mm -hmm. I found out Fabio's 62. Oh. oh. I would have thought he was God older bless. than that. How, how does he look? Hmm. 
Well, do you want me to do yes. that now, too? Well, Larry, I can't do everything <laughs> well, here. I thought that's what the point was. Well, I didn't care how old oh, he was. Oh, I'm sorry. You want me to I... read number one? Well, oh, yeah. here we go. Yeah, Is there this he a goes. present day picture of him, though? Do I, we know? I'm, I'm guessing. Oh, well, I'm... Something's wrong with the triple uh, toggle here. Oh, there we go. There we go. He still looks great. He great. Ooh. That's him, huh? That's him. He really rocked me on, didn't he? And I am yeah, he did. He something. Anyway. Uh, all right, number one already. Uh, it's Thursday. It's about time we pause and do the hustle. Hey, well, though, that's a pretty good Here new go. promo for WGN Morning News. <laughs> Get all the ladies of GN. Now, doing how about all you guys wear these great little outfits? Oh, Robin, you know men don't dance. Now, what was the hustle an actual? Is this the actual dance of the hustle? No, I don't know. It's not even a dance. They're just kind of prancing around. Oh, this is choreographed. Do we have it's any choreographed, but this, not very well. Can or? someone tell us if the hustle was an actual dance? I mean, it was an actual dance. It was a dance, yes. Yeah. But this isn't it. No, I don't know that this is it. This is, uh, I think this is from overseas, so that's like, It's an interpretation. Yes. Mm. Yeah, a terrible one. But that's the nine at nine. Go nine at nine. 